Take two. Yes. Take two. Take two. Story fandom. Dose. Tell us. Dropping a dose? Ugh. Ah. Uh. <laughs> I noticed you got it, her. So we are here for episode Trace. Right? Trace. Trace. No. Four. Oh. Twackle. Three Quackle. was the one that she didn't watch. That's right, which we did not like. I think apparently I'm trying to block out our memory. You were like, there was no three. <laughs> there was no three. Three did not exist. The dregs are not real. Three did not happen. Mm-hmm. You know. Wow. It didn't happen or else. Wah. Wah. That was so terrible. That yeah, is... we weren't a fan of that episode. No. No. Not at all. It is off terribly, but it did not end well. Like, let's give them Gallifrey, like, completely massacred and... The master did it and all this other stuff. And then you guys get these guys. And, and you get a very, very poorly done attempt to point out the danger of global warming. Like, yeah, oh yeah, my gosh. That was really bad. Look, it's Earth. Okay, but we're, we should stop. We're not here to talk about yeah, how bad no, episode was. Please, let's just move on. We're here to hope that this Tesla episode is better. It's so please. shiny. It's so smooth. I know. Look, I'm like loving the this. first two episodes so of this series were amazing. Please. We know you guys can do it. It's shiny. Please. Sorry. It's shiny. I'm done pleading, and they're done. I have anxiety, so I have to like fidget with stuff at all times. Otherwise, you won't get me sitting here, just watching. I was inspired to build my Niagara generator. Tesla's <laughs> hair always kills me. A way for each of us to reach beyond our immediate sphere into every corner of the Earth. So, the internet. I calculate it comes from Mars. So is it the Canadian Ice Warriors? Uh, that's... Who is it? I don't know. Is it? I don't think it's going to be any old. Anyways. Mm-hmm. I was thinking when they said signal from Mars, that's the Ice Warriors are supposed to be, but... Yeah. Maybe that looks kind of like an ice water design. It also reminds me of the cubes, remember? Because <laughs> it's small. It's cubes. Maybe a little bit. Maybe the doctor. Yep. Mm. Hey, I just wish you seen anything weird around here. I don't think that was an ice warrior. No, I don't think it was either. <laughs> Express, we traveling star. This is Graham. <laughs> <laughs> We're doing this nice. Shame you're a big fat liar. <laughs> <laughs> kind of was. Yeah. Pretty much. That almost looked like the weapon, the um... Oh, what are their names? The dinosaur people, the underneath the planet use. Oh, uh, like Bastra? Yeah. I don't remember <coughs> what they were called. Me neither. No, maybe no, not. No, it's not because there's no green skin. Very pale. It's the Emperor. Star Wars. Oh. Sorry. That was like the guy that died. Silurian. Oh. Yes, yeah, Lurian is the name of the dinosaur yeah. people. I agree with Mr. Tesla. If anyone can make God, push her ass off the train. Hmm. So, you guys ever hear the story? Once Tesla, he didn't have the money to stay at some inn. So he came to the box for the electronic opponents and told him, This is a death ray. You must never open it, for it can destroy whole cities. This will be my payment to you. And they took it. They're the box. I don't stay there for I don't know how long they stayed there. And they left. Nobody touched this box until after World War II. And I opened it up and discovered it was just a bunch of random electronic components. All this kind of shoved together. It was completely worthless. It would never work. It's like, oh my god, Tesla. What a dick move. You just cheated a hotel out of the fucking... St- out of the money they owe- you owe them. Wow. You swore a lot. I'm an American citizen. And you are trespassing in front of my I don't blame him there. There is <laughs> ah, That's such a lie. This is gonna be something special. 
And what did he invent? Well, he invented the, um... I am Graham. The water McCoy. Yep. Tell him, Doc. I made it. Made out of spoons. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> you know, when, when I first arrived in America, I had four cents to my name. I, I was well up at the journey. But still, I thought, this is the beginning. This is what society is with You have the wrong inventor, man. It's Lethal Attends. Not a man in the gold. Making my feet on the ground. Why? What is it? It always was Tesla against Edison. Yeah. And like Edison. People nowadays, you're either a Tesla man or you're an Edison man. Well, Edison was a horrible person. <laughs> he really was. He stole patents left and right. I know. <laughs> really was terrible. I mean, don't be wrong. I'm pretty sure Tesla had his moments. I mean, the man loved a pigeon, for God's sakes. <laughs> but... So, uh, I would pick so, Tesla so over you? Edison's. I would take Ed- Tesla over Edison. Edison man or a Tesla man? If I had to pick between those two, I think I'd go with Tesla. Julius. Just because... Julius is like, I don't really... <laughs> Julius is like, I don't know enough about either one of these people to have an opinion. <laughs> what about you, sweetie? Tesla. Yeah. Because he was weird. Really weird. But he wasn't as big of a... An outright dick. Yes. <laughs> like Edison. Like yeah, he has summer. everyone else like doing work. But I do not steal. I have no yeah. <laughs> There are a thousand patents in the man just didn't understand the American sense of humor. Yeah, uh huh. Huh. <laughs> she don't like this guy. I'm saying. It's pain for them. Why? Oh, I don't know. It's not a spaceship, Can though. Get them to fix something, maybe? <laughs> I don't know. Scorpions? Well, alien scorpions. Jagging we saw them scorpions. a little bit in the preview, remember? They were being chased by them at one point. They crashed into a cart. So arachnos. we're just gonna go with the arachnos again? Apparently. And she's gonna Apparently. have. It's like another version of the arachnos almost, right? Because the original like arachnos, arachnos. Well, they were red with all the like, just like they were red with like little black horns and eyes and stuff, and the weird giant spider body. But this one looks like she was black with like red highlights. So maybe it's not the arachnos. Maybe it's knockgrass. Don't do that. Don't do that. It's weird, though. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I have one. I'm, I'm really curious because I remember the last time they faced the Arachnos and it didn't end well, remember? Mm-mm. That was one of David Tennant's great remember dark Remember the Turning time. Left episode yeah. where if Donna hadn't been there, he would have just mm. died with the Arachnos? Yep. Man. Some dark days. Because he had just lost Rose. Yeah, that was that. Uh, yeah. Wait, who was? Being was? Right. Yeah. But, I mean, on some part of me hopes that this is the case. Because one of my big complaints of last season, last series, was that Jody's doctor was just sunshine and rainbows all the freaking time. And the doctor, she didn't have any of the doctor's darkness. Well, she's still kind of like that, though. Is Edison still there? We, we don't get to see Edison's reaction to the TARDIS. Oh, new pump. <laughs> this is the mechanical factory. Do you really want him on the TARDIS? I mean, really. You and his should be on the QT, right? So get this door signs out. Claire. 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 Get through. Huh? Get through. Like that. You can see your city, but your city cannot see There's not a lot of the Ragnar. Yeah. Yeah. I remember thinking that when we saw them in the commercial. It's okay. It's called skin, though. 
It is. So it's they, not supposed to be the arachnus at all. No, I guess not. But please stop playing with those. <laughs> Sorry, that's a terrible face. <laughs> really? <laughs> okay. So do, do. they do. Maybe it's like a sister race. Yeah, I'm just like a. a, a a related race to the Arachnos. The yeah, thing the Arachnos. What bother me is if no one mentions the Arachnos. It's exactly like it's like they took the Arachnos and just like repurposed it. They just like took a bunch. Of I was of super Arachnos excited when I saw the commercial and I thought stuff. to myself it looked like the Arachnos, so I was excited for a second. But now that nobody's mentioning it and they have a completely different name and she's walking on two legs like a human, I'm like, mm, maybe I'm not so excited anymore. Basically, they took Arachnos and a bunch of other random stuff and just, like, mashed it into one weird-looking alien. And they're, like, you know, instead of uh, killing everybody and doing stuff like that, they're just... Well, the Arachnos, I can see not coming back. They were supposed to be that one last ship escaped the, the Great War of the Time Lords. But they don't make an alien like this. Yeah, they make it new. Well, maybe the, the Doctor will recognize the something when they get close. I don't know. Something Although something original was the pating, so maybe not. I am forever going to complain about the pating. I've noticed. <laughs> yep. Sound a lot like the Ragnarok there. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> You're a bad boss. Wow. Seriously? <laughs> 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 What is this? Meh. Where are you all going? Ha ha ha! Is it gonna be a proper reaction? <laughs> this. That's what David's been waiting for. Yeah. This whole series. <laughs> them don't know. Them both bad. Why this one? What kills me is whenever stuff like this happened with David Tennant and Matt Smith, they got scary and dark, and they handled their shit. Like, yes. <sighs> she just wants everyone to just, like, hug and have puppies and rainbows shooting out their butts. Yes. Like, this is bothering me, because it's like, <laughs> just... <laughs> rainbow come out out of puppy butt, you. It's just, like it's bothering me, like, David Tennant... No. All of his monologues, like, come on. Yeah, really? they, like, David Jenner and Matt Smith, Crystal Eichelson, and, and Peter Capaldi. And Peter Capaldi, all of them can yeah. be terrifying. Remember Down Heaven right. Sent and Hell Bent? Come on. Can we just. Really? See, that's. Because they knew, they knew they couldn't. Bobby like, Bobby. it wasn't possible to save everybody. Yeah. And do everything. But There's this always... doctor doesn't seem to get that. Yeah. I've always felt like there's been a very dark theme with the Doctor because he's such a... He, and I'm saying this because I've went before Jody, of course, was always such a clever person. But the only thing that was different between him and the Master, they were a lot alike, is the respect for life. Yeah. The Master gives no shits. If you take that away from the Doctor, he would be the Master. Yeah. So I there's guess. none of that darkness in, in Jody's Doctor very well. We saw a hint of it maybe in the first two episodes. Yeah, but... Even then, that's because the master kind of brought it out. Yeah. All right. What's and even on? then, what did she do? Nothing. Glower. Exactly. And she just marooned him with <coughs> the light beings. That's it. It's killing Edison that they want you and not him. <gasps> even now, really? This place. This one place. Worked. I'm gonna be in the house. 
It's a Decepticon. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> that guy's like, nope. I'm out. Oh, well, they're smart enough to do that. Oh, yeah, they, they ran into each other. They are terrible. Yeah, that was Kelly. <laughs> oh my god, he shot one with a pistol and it died. They keep running into each other and tripping over. They're the clumsiest scorpions I've ever seen. They're not scary, they're basically characters who are the scorpion. Look at them! Yeah. God! You could sneeze at one and it would die. These are cold. Huh? <laughs> what? Well, she said that tunnel led back to more Did she? Yeah. Once you the thing. I want to know how they figured that out. I guess maybe that's where they came out of. I don't know. Yes. <laughs> she's still doing it in such a cheerful way that it doesn't feel like she she's is. about to kill something. What? It doesn't feel like it. What? I don't know. The doctor. Mm. Okay. I don't really mind it. If, I wouldn't be such a problem yeah. if she showed more depth of character. What are you doing? My shoes. She's just like one character oh. with one personality and she's just bland. I mean, she's a good actress. That's what I like. I like the people on the show. It's the writing that bothers me sometimes. Yeah. Like the pating. Good. Oh my <laughs> Go God. back to the pating. Pating. Let's just see if we can finish this up. Okay. Why would the TARDIS not have enough power to do both? I feel like the TARDIS should. It should. <clears throat> Don't worry. If you have a pistol, it's fine. It'll work. Maybe poke him with a stick. Sneeze. Look at him funny. What? That's what I can do. Yeah, he can never go this simple death way. Right? We'll be okay. We'll be okay. No. Yeah, well. Mm -hmm. yeah. You guys died from a single pistol shot. I know. No. We'll be no. okay. No. So they're all being sent back to the ship and they're all gonna die. No, apparently the ship ran. Thank you. Thank you all. Don't what? Care. Whatever anyone says. I'll let them talk. That is scary. Okay. So this is what I take as a whole. It is a better episode. <laughs> oh my God. It is a better episode than last than week. Than last week. Yeah. It yeah. is still not up to my personal standard for Doctor Who. What's your thought? <coughs> okay, so... I like that they were willing to do all of that. Like, they were going to kill her, whatever, so on and so forth. But the point is, at no point, zero <laughs> points, at no point does she do the thing that David Tennant does, and Matt Smith does, and Peter Capaldi does... And even Christopher Eccleston did, and everyone else, of I'm a Time Lord. At no point does she even say who she is or what she is. At no point does the Scythra even care. And it's just like, it just kind of goes over the head. Because there's no fear. The Scythra doesn't get afraid until they're finally being shot with lightning. There's no 
fear. There's I think no it's because intimidation. There's nothing. It's just she's meh. not the oncoming. It's storm, just she saved. Right. She but saved that's the what day. I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. She's not the oncoming storm. Shouldn't have the same. And again, I'm but not saying this is Jody. Is, but she should be. Yes, that the doctor should be. It was more just like she saved the day, guys. The doctor Skithra escaped off to do whatever they're going to do now, and yeah, they still didn't everybody die. Everybody else, when David Tennant fought the Ragnarok, everybody's fine, and he, we're all fine. They all died. <sighs> David the tenth doctor basically committed genocide. Well, they, they, they were monsters. Yeah, they were bad guys. Monsters died. Well, because they were monsters, and they were about to release all these Even monsters. Even Rose monsters. had more intimidation. Than she does. That's the thing. <laughs> Even Clara did when she kind of took over as the doctor for a while, which everyone complained about. Not she me. still had that cockiness and that Cocky. I am the doctor. Right. Even yeah. though she wasn't. But they don't have that here. <clears throat> it's like they, they wanted to that. revamp everything, which is great. You want to revamp it. You want to make it your own. But you don't throw away some of the best parts about yeah. it. Yeah, you kept the TARDIS. Yeah, you kept the fact that she's Jeez. from Gallifrey. But you didn't keep what made the Doctor the Doctor. Yeah. Well, first of all, I actually don't like this, the current TARDIS. I really don't. I, I like the black sign on the outside. The black sign. <laughs> Where it says the police box. Oh. I like that it's black. But that doesn't tell us anything of her character because, yeah, it got darker and the TARDIS looks more imposing, but why is the TARDIS the only thing that got a little bit more imposing on the outside? That's it. That's all it's, it like, it's fine to have a sugary personality if they're willing to have the Doctor still have... The Doctorness. Yeah. The Doctor's always been described as the oncoming storm, as like a supernova, a dying star. This intense Yeah, and each of them thing. had their own thing. Each of them had some kind of intense big thing. And Even Matt Smith, let's be honest. Matt he, Smith was like a child half the time, and he still <laughs> had those moments, had that doctorness that made him a Time Lord, that made him so imposing, he that made him had say... even more... You don't want to piss me off. I'm at the Pandorica. You don't want to piss me off. Back off. And they did. Because (laughs) he was there and he was the doctor and that was it. I don't think she could pull that off. No. No, I don't think she could pull off Demon's Run. That's what they took away from the character. I don't think she could pull off Demon's Run. I don't think she could do a lot of of the things that Matt Smith did or that uh, Capaldi did or that Tennant did. Or... Even Eccleston. I don't think she could tell the freaking little boy to go to his room. He would laugh at her and throw a banana. <laughs> a banana? I'm just saying. A banana? The good in potassium. Banana. Like you, that was the episode one. You're a little bit younger for that one. I don't think we've watched that one with you because it's scary. Yeah. It was on the one day and I had to turn it off because she was there and I knew she would get upset. Yeah, it was. But still, like, Panini. all of those things. Like, even in that episode, everybody lived. Everything ended up okay. But there were still those <coughs> moments. I know. <sighs> this one just wasn't it. Tumor de Tata. I'm waiting for it. A Tumor de Tata. A Kuna Matata. Matata. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's the thing. The well, doctor's no not worries. a Kuna Matata. Well, yeah, but this doctor is. Matata. Yeah. All right, well, if you agree or you disagree or you thought of something that we didn't, because let's be honest, we're not picking it all apart right now. We're just... Comment, Uh, like, subscribe. Ring that bell. Do all those things, and we will answer comments. Ring that bell. We appreciate feedback. Ring that bell. Yep. And we will discuss it with you in the comments ring, or up, on Twitter ring, or whatever. Ring, 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 I finally figured ring, out bell, Twitter. Ring, bell, ring, so bell, bell. I am now on there. Which is better than I am. Bell. Not really, but. Kind of. Ring. I ring that bell, bell like Clara keeps saying. <laughs> All right. Till next time.